Girl, did you hear what's going on, honey? Let me tell you. Nicki Minaj, she came for Wendy Williams in the new song with Deja Cat. And Nicki Minaj, because you know Deja Cat, she got a song called Call Say So, right? So Nicki Minaj, she hopped on it to do a remix. And when I tell you, everybody is loving that damn remix. People saying it's fire. But guess what? Nicki Minaj, she came for Wendy Williams. <laughs> Yes, she did. Nicki Minaj, she came for Wendy Williams, honey. And you know, Wendy Williams and Nicki Minaj, they've been going back and forth, been going real deep, you know, with um, the jabs. Wendy Williams stay talking about uh, Patty, Nicki Minaj's boyfriend. Uh, Nicki Minaj stay talking about Wendy Williams, man, honey. Girl, we're going to talk all about it. We're going to talk about those lyrics. Honey, Nicki came for um, Wendy's face. Yeah, ouch. Yikes, right? Yikes. She came for a face. So let's tell me. Let me tell you something, okay? If it's your first time here at Gossip Girl XOXO, baby, you are in for a treat. Over here, we love the gossip, okay? We upload three times a day on this YouTube channel, and we don't even stop there. We in the community tab, always uploading pictures, throwbacks, new pictures of celebrity. We be dragging them and uplifting them at the same damn time. Baby, it's a sight to see. I only give a little. But the gossip gang, they come and they give so much gossip. You got to stay tuned, okay? I don't want you to miss a thing. That's why I want you to subscribe and click that notification bell. And you know what? We have to give a special shout out to our gossip gang member, Sade Davis, okay, from Chicago. Baby, you've been spotted out. Gossip gang member, Sade Davis. You've been shouted out, baby, from Chicago, okay? I just want to say thank you so much from the bottom of my heart for always commenting, liking, sharing the video, just showing us love. I appreciate you. And, baby, if you want a shout out, baby, ain't nothing but a thing for me. I love shouting my people out. Just make sure you comment. Be one of the first to comment on the video or always comment, and I'm going to shout your ass out, okay? Let's get to it. So... We're going to read the um, the lyrics first. Then we're going to go into the past. We're going to hear Nicki Minaj drag Wendy. And we're going to hear Wendy drag Nicki Minaj. Y'all ready for this? Y'all ready? Do you think Nicki Minaj or do you think Wendy Williams is going to come back and clap back? I think so. Them two, they've been going at it since uh, Remy Ma and Nicki Minaj was going at it. Because you know Remy Ma and Wendy Williams... They supposed to be like real good Judy's, good friends. And then Nicki Minaj, she on a song talking about some ex Miss Ellen. Oh, Wendy Williams, she was in our feelings. Ever since then, Wendy Williams has been dragging Nicki Minaj every chance she get. Uh, it's because of that damn Ellen comment. Mm-hmm. So let's check this out. All right, so you guys can see it says, this is the lyrics to the new song with Dojo Cat. Okay, say so. It says, why are you talking about who body fake? Okay, because Wendy, she was going off on her on um, Nicki Minaj having fake body, right? She says, with all them fillers in your face. No, she didn't. Oh, no, she didn't. Girl, uh, you just full of hate. That real ass and keep your man home. She talking about Wendy. We know you got a real booty. But that real booty ain't keeping your man home, okay? She's talking about Kevin. Yeah, you ain't know what happened with Kevin? Girl, let me tell you, it's a whole big mess. He been cheating on her. They say he cheating with niggas and women, okay? And not only that, did you know he got a baby with another woman? And when it comes to, to pick the other woman or, or Wendy, did you know he chose the other woman and the baby? Mm-hmm. Yeah, Wendy Williams, she was hurt about that, you know? But um, she says, now you're looking silly. That's word to silicone, okay? Mm, y'all heard that? Girl, what y'all think about that, you know? Talking about somebody's spouse, it's a low blow. Especially when we know Wendy Williams, she's still healing from that. That was just recent. And to put it in a song, that's a low blow. That ain't right. That ain't right. Y'all supposed to be uplifting each other. 
But girl, when y'all seen Wendy Williams and how she kept on dragging uh, Nicki Minaj, because I'll tell you one thing, Wendy Williams, she put out more shots on Nicki Minaj than Nicki Minaj put on Wendy Williams. It's like anytime Wendy Williams get a chance to dog Nicki Minaj out, she does it. She stay obsessed talking about Nicki Minaj. It's like if you don't like the girl... Stop talking about it. Don't report on her, you know? But she got to report on her because Nikki is hot topics. And when she gets the chance, she's not equal. She's not fair. She drags Nicki Minaj, okay? You don't believe me? Let's see. Thank you for giving it up, you know, full oh, effect. I did this for you, Wendy. Thank you. You're welcome. Um, so congratulations on all your success. Thank you. I mean, really. Thank you, guys. But, you know, other than a couple of things, we don't know that much about you. So this is our chance to really talk. So uh -oh. don't... No, come on now. Uh-oh, Wendy. Let me loosen you up. How you doing? How you doing? <laughs> <laughs> okay, so now, I'm here now, and, you know, Pink Friday's coming out. We love your persona. Thank you. You know, I mean, the wigs. You know I can appreciate a wig. I know you can. The, the animated faces that you make, the English accent that we sometimes hear you put on. It's right. All, it's all a part of, of who you are. And, and the song Roman's Revenge. Yeah. There are a lot of females who've um, criticized you. Um, like, who are you talking about? What are you talking about? Uh, what do you... They know who I'm talking about. Oh, okay. See, that's the thing. That's the thing. When you put out records, you know, only the guilty ones feel like you're talking about them. Okay. So, you know... If you have nothing to worry about, if you never came out saying stuff, if you never, you know, came out saying you're ungrateful, book, then you wouldn't worry about it. Oh. But I don't get into that. I feel like my music, my fans know everything that's going on. Every time I talk, every time I spit raps, my, my fans know who I'm talking about, what I'm talking about. I don't have to sit up here and detail it. No, for what? Gotcha. This is about so Friday. In love, I, I noticed that you're wearing a, a ring. No, I'm not in love, Wendy. Oh. <laughs> Um, you know, I'm in love with my music. I'm in love with Pink Friday. I'm married to Benjamin Franklin. That's all I care about. Yes, yes. Yeah. Well, listen, at, at 26 years old, as far as I'm concerned, that's the correct answer. Thank it should you. be all about your career Thank at this you. point. And that's what I tell my barbs and my Ken barbs. Don't chase these boys and all that stuff. Go to school. Go and, to college. And don't no depend babies. on anybody. Don't be having babies. Do your thing. And no babies anytime soon. Good for you. No. You keep rocking out. Um, Mick, Nikki, by the way, um, has a deal with MAC lipstick, and I love the color. Like, here's this soon-to-be washed-up rapper who can't keep my name out of its mouth. And I, I love it. I sit here like, okay, I keep talking. <laughs> Ooh. Say <laughs> some more. But, um, I don't like the cover. You know, I think she's trying too hard. And I get in a Cardi B world. <laughs> you know, you know, and you've been here for a moment, you're trying to retain your, your position in rap music and stuff, and I get, you know, Remy is on your tail, and little Kim is about to do something awful. She's about to come out with an album, Sink or Swim. So this is her idea of swimming. I find it <clears throat> desperate and distasteful. I like Nas being low key. That's part of the, that, that's one of the things that I like. Like, you listen to his lyrics and stuff like that. Like, he's a cool, type dude who could smash a Nicki Minaj any day he wants, but doesn't have to claim her for a girlfriend. This is nothing against Nicki, but if you'd like to plead your case, you can take it on Ellen, and, and, and I'm sure Ellen will understand. I'm done. I'm done. Do you mention Gucci Man's body every time you, you, you mention him? Or when you're discussing his wife, do you mention his man down, his charge? Three times, three times in a row, bitch doing a show acting like she fucking stuttering John. Talk about, is it manslaughter? What does that mean? What does that mean? What does manslaughter? Is that, does it mean that you actually killed somebody? Did it mean that you murdered? Where was you at when Kevin had his dick? Name date. And it's not about about you doing your job. There are people who report the news and there are people who do it with an evil intent in their heart, viciousness. 
And I pray for you because I know you're hurting and I know you must be sick and humiliated. All right, so that was just a sample. When I tell you it got real nasty and vicious, but you know what? I got a question. Do you guys think that Wendy Williams and Nicki Minaj could ever end the beef and become cool like Nicki and Wendy? I mean, shit, that ain't a good example because shit, <laughs> Wendy and Nene just got into it, right? But um, maybe not friends, but can they be cordial where they not always dogging each other out or dissing each other? Because it seemed like it's going to constantly be Nicki Minaj versus Wendy Williams, you know? And I just hope they can get past it. Wendy stopped throwing shots. Nikki stopped throwing shots. And, you know, they can just really get to work in, in business. But you know what? I heard, I don't know how true it is, but this is what I'm hearing, honey. I'm hearing that Nick Cannon is about to replace Wendy Williams. So if she's not doing her talk show, will she go back on radio? Or do you think that she'll retire? Right, and if she retires and when D Nick Cannon takes over, the drama will end. Let's hopefully, because you never know, Wendy Williams she can pop up on a different platform and keep the drama moving. You get what I mean? So we just have to see, we're gonna have to pray for them. And I just want to let you guys know you're the best. I thank you so much. Make sure you like and you share, subscribe, and I'm gonna see you guys sooner than later. Bye. <laughs>